Okay, uh, Nathaniel, Nathaniel's Insanity. Hey, how's it going? Um, <clears throat> I've recently been in touch with a company called uh, One Up Card, and they sell cleaning products for your various systems. Um, any of the old school, um, I don't think they have Atari, but anything from NES and up, they have cleaning cartridges for. Um, if I like this, I'm going to have to talk to them about making an Atari one, because that's what I could really use. But I'm gonna open this up and we'll see what, what we'll see what we got here. I'm kind of excited. I believe this is gonna be the uh, the uh, mm, N64 cleaning kit. They ship it pretty safely. I mean the packaging is good. No complaints there. Let's see what we got here. Now they kind of gifted this to me because I'm going to do what I'm doing. I'm going to show it off and give a little review. Um, I'm not sure what these are for yet, but all will, more will be revealed. Uh, it says 1UP Card Cleaners for the Game Boy and more. 1UPCard.com Moisten Directions Moisten Fluid Sorry, sorry, folks. <clears throat> Moisten fluid, ba fluid pad. Rub against game contacts. Buff with a dry pad. Um, that sounds pretty easy. Those. Let's see here. We've got uh, these ones. Oh, wait. That's in a hole. Do, 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 do. So this must be the cleaning fluid. <clears throat> one up card fluid it says moisten fluid pad of your one up card and rub against game contacts buff with dry pad we read that already it looks like it's basically i'm not going to tell you the ingredients if you could read them on there that's all you but uh yeah their formula is is pretty legit what i just read um, I'll talk to him about maybe in the future if I can reveal what it is. But uh, let's see how it smells. Hmm, doesn't, doesn't really smell like anything. I figured it would smell like alcohol or something, but it doesn't. <clears throat> so there was that. And then these here. These are 1UP card. This is for... Up oh, cleans games for Atari, Nintendo, Super Nintendo, Sega, Genesis, N64, and more. So like any Commodore cards, old uh, <clears throat> Intellivision cards. If we can do the Atari, we can do the Intellivision cards for real. Let's set that right. Oh, let's set that right there. Um, nice. They sent me a sticker. We all love stickers. That's definitely a bonus. Thank you, guys. Thank you. I believe it was Adam who I talked to. He is the owner, I do believe, of this company, 1UP Card. And I was turned on to it by my friend Jody, <clears throat> who I recently sent an NES, and it worked here, but when I got there, it didn't work. So he did some research, and he found these guys. So they send you this. Um, for They make them for, I believe, Sega. NES, they might do a Game Boy one, um, they do this, and, and a few more, um, so I'm guessing with this, there's directions, oh, this is a cartridge cleaner 1UP, keep your games clean, with a 1UP card cartridge cleaner, to clean N64, insert and remove several times, do not use with fluid, do not store in console game Oh, oh, and do not store on the console. Game on, friggin' right. Um, so we'll try this out. We'll we'll try try this out in the N64. I got like four of them in the game room, um, and we'll try cleaning up a couple cartridges with this also, and we'll see how that goes. It's kind of exciting. I really appreciate the uh, the hookup, Adam from One Up Cards. Thank you very much. Alrighty, <clears throat> most of my systems are pretty clean, but um, so to, to use the 1UP card to clean your N64 or your NES or Sega or whatever cartridge that you got for the particular system, um, you don't wet the inside of this. Um, you just push it in, 
take it out, push it in, take it out, sorry for the shaky camera, push it in, take it out. Now I can't really see if there's any filth in there necessarily. Like I say, my, my systems are pretty clean, but I can feel that it's, it's grabbing and it's definitely would be um, cleaning up those pins in there a little bit. Boom. My friend, um, my friend Jody actually got, um, the one for the NES and like I said, the NES didn't work when it got there. It worked when it left my house, but it didn't work when it got there. Um, so we got one of these and he used it a few times and he, he claimed it worked, which is awesome. Okay. Now let's check this out. This is the, um, these are for the like Game Boys and stuff like that. Cleaner for Game Boy and more. Now let's clean up, um, let's try cleaning up a Game Boy game with one of these. Uh, thankfully it wasn't impossible to get into. Okay, yeah. The fluid side is a little bit rough, which is good. Um, you don't want it too rough, like sandpaper rough, but it's a little rough. Um, and then the dry pad side is just, it's just a dry pad. So let's go with this monster trucks, which is not that exciting. I don't really have any awesome, um, Game Boy games, but this is obviously in advance. This is your original Game Boy. Um, let's, let's do this. Let's throw some of this on there. It doesn't say shake, so I'm not going to shake, but I'm going to twist off. And let's see, fluid side. You can see that where that got wet, nice. And then we'll try this. Just kind of buffing those pins up a little bit. With the wet side. And now we'll go and buff it up with the dry side. Buff it up, buff it up. Now I can't tell, ooh, they look, you can't really see in there on this, but those pins do look nice and shiny. While we're at it, we may as well do the advance just to see that they do fit in there. Oh, it does work perfectly with the Advance. It would work for Game Gear too, I'm sure. Oh, there goes my dog. <laughs> Here at the Ice Maker. Yep, that would be my Chihuahua. Let me buff it up. That was that. Um, let's do... Let's do an NES. I've got Pugsley Scavenger Hunt here. I think I'm going to have to yell at my dog because my fiance is sleeping and he's down there barking his stinking little chihuahua head off. Hold on. Batman, shut your mouth. Now I see fluid side. Pretty explanatory. Dry side. These are nice looking cards too. This is a good looking product for real. I mean, it, it, it seems very, very professional, just the way the things look. Good on them. Now, I have cleaned this before because it's a pretty pricey game, but I'm going to do it again just to show y'all what I'm doing. Kind of rubbing that fluid on there. Now, this fluid is a fluid that won't rust your pins. Um, as long as you, you know, buff it off, there's, there's not any water in it per se, maybe like 2% water. Um, if you ever are going to use like rubbing alcohol or something, you want to make sure that you have the highest percentage alcohol that you can get because it will rust your pins. Ah, there. Buff it and buff it. Mm, I can smell it now. Definitely working. 
So that was that. We just cleaned Pugsley. Bam. Now, I think this one also said Atari. So, sometime I'll show you the trick how to get... A lot of Atari games have, like, a plastic latch here. I'll show you sometime how to get beyond that plastic latch. But for now, this one is Star Voyager. Uh, made by Imagic. And they don't have that plastic that flap on there. So, same idea. I'm really excited to do all my Atari games, honestly. Just kind of rub those pins. Rub those pins. Scrub them a little bit. Flip it over to the buffing side. And buff, buff, buff. Buff, 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 buff. And I'd say... I'd say that that did the trick. I'd say, you know, we did what we're supposed to do. Um, I'm sure the pins are a lot cleaner. I mean, you can tell. You can't necessarily tell unless I open it up. Um, but the pins are, are very shiny in there. They look really good. I'm excited to maybe use this on one of my other N64s and pop it open and see how clean that this will actually get it. Um, I believe it, it feels like it's going to do a good job. It really feels like it's going to do a good job. Shaky camera again. Sorry, folks. My setup isn't the greatest right now. But <clears throat> there you go. There's your demo on the 1UP card. And I'm going to play some games in a little bit. Um, peace. I hope you enjoyed. Check these guys out. Look them up online. I'll have the link in my comments. Um, enjoy your day.